What's up guys, Ruxin34 back with another video. We have the final 10 of our 12 10s. The Blue Eyes White Dragon 10. At the end of this, we're going to go over every pull we got from these 10s. All 12 of them. And we're going to see how we did on our $3,500 purchase. Pretty epic. Also, for the giveaway. We give away these three cards. Drop off from Legacy of Darkness. We got a Mystical Knight of Jackal from Dark, what is that, Dark Revelation one? Yeah, there we go. And Dark Room of Nightmare First Edition from Pharaonic Guardian. Like the video, be subscribed, and let me know how many foils do you think we pulled from the 12 tins, not including the promos. So not including the 12 promos, just other foils. How many do you think we pulled? You can go back and cheat if you want, I don't care. Or you can just guess. It's more fun if you guess because it's not really a award for winning, you know? All right. We're also going to open up two OTS 13 packs, not 14. Let's see if we can pull a Book of Moon real quick. And then we will hop into the Blue Eyes tin and hopefully pull something epic to end it off. Formula Synchron, nice. And Where Art Thou? I think Formula Synchron is pretty nice as a, as a common. Next pack, OTS 13. Can we pull an Ultimate Rear? Xyz Unit, Dimension Fortress Weapon, and Deep Sea Diva, nice one. Pretty good pulls out of those two. All right, now let's hop into the Blue Eyes tin. Let's see what we can pull from the legendary engine of destruction or whatever it's called. All right. This actually has some. This one's actually sealed really well. Oh, there we go. There's a hole in it. Perfect. This is actually one of the best sealed ones of all the tins, though. So I'm definitely, you know, destroying the value on this one. That's okay. That's okay. Here we go. Blue Eyes White Dragon. After the Gear Free 10, I'm, I'm more optimistic. Here we go, promo. Near Mint. Let's do this. Oh. Okay, not incredible. Not incredible. But it is better than the other Blue Eyes out of the uh, 25k special. Check that video out. Definitely better condition than that one. So I'll take that. This one is, yeah, probably light play with all that, but that's okay. It's not like mod play like the other one or worse. That one, I think, maybe was even heavy play. All right, Blue Eyes White Dragon set up there. Let's see what we can pull our final packs from 2003. Let's start with Labyrinth of Nightmare. Last night, not last night. Why not? Last time, we got a sweet pull out of here. We got a secret rare. Our only secret rare, I think, from this, from these uh, tins. Whew. Lightning Conger. Can we start off hot again? Dancing Fairy. Let's not have another dud tin in it. Come on. Worm Drake. We had Worm Drake last time. Amazon Archer. Come on. Destiny Board. Start them off hot. Okay. Another Destiny board. F. F in the chat. Hopefully not an F in the chat, I hope. Last time we got an L in the 25K. Well, not last time. In the 25K, we got an L, and it did not bode well. This time we got an F, so not good either, really, but <laughs> so pretty cool. We also got another Swordsman of Lance. Pretty awesome. Forgiving Maiden and St. Joan. Almost dropped that, but I caught it. Good start, guys. Destiny board, I'm taking that. That is epic. Pharaoh's Servant has not been too kind to us. I think we pulled Nobleman of Cross out, and that was it. I think, for all 12 tens. Well, 11, because we haven't opened this one yet. But So far, we are 1 for 11. Not too good. That is better ratios than 1, than one for 21, or 0 for 21, but still not great. Here we go. Three-headed Guido. Infinite Dismissal. Bubonic Vermin. Seven completed. Skull Invitation. Last time we had an error pack out of Ferro Servant, which was pretty awesome. Harpy's brother. Always good to see that one. So no error tin this time, or no error pack. So we did get an error pack as well out of Ferro Servant. So that was another cool thing it gave us. Magic Ruler. Magic Ruler with the spell on the inside. Pretty cool. Pretty unique, I think, for these tins. I think it's only in these tins that it was like that. Here we go. Turtle Oath, you see, Spell, MRL, pretty cool. It is not an error, though. They're all like that. Twin Long Rods, number two. Course of Sanctuary. Mechanical Snail. Giant Trunade. I'm taking it, and that's really cool because it has the spell on it. It says Magic Ruler, but or MRL, but it has the spell, so that's super cool. Super Rare, Giant Trunade. We got the Giant Turtle who feeds on flames. Very nice, very nice. So we've got two foils already. These tins are so much better than 25k ones. So funny. Blue Eyes is actually treated as well, because that's where we got the Blue Eyes White Dragon in the in the video. Alright, Metal Raiders. 
Come on, Metal Raiders. Give us something epic. We've only pulled, like, Magic Jammer. We pulled Suijin last time. That was pretty cool. Can we get a Skull? Uh, not Skull. Summon Skull. There we go. Gay Guardian. Time Wizard. Solemn Judgment. Barrel Dragon. Like, any of those. Those are awesome. Dis There's more that I didn't even say. Disc Magician. Rabbit Horseman. Steel Scorpion. Little Chimera. Oh, man. Sort of deep-seated. Pump King, the King of Ghosts. And Guilty of the D-Knight. Ah, I just want something from Metal Raiders so much. The good thing is, spoiler alert, if we open some 2002 tins, let's say we maybe do that, they have two Metal Raiders packs. That's going to be pretty cool. All right. Legend of Blue Eyes, White Dragon, the last pack. Our last chance at fire. Here we go. Can both Blue Eyes tins have a Blue Eyes? No, there's zero chance. I'm just going to say it now. If it happens, I'm, I'm going to get accused of... <laughs> accused of... Why does this feel really skinny? This feels like there's not enough cards in here. All right, basic insect. Ray and temperature. Watch it be an error and no, no foil or rare. Dragon treasure. Fire Yaru and... Hit the like button for luck. Arm Ninja. Okay. There's definitely enough cards though. Lesser, Dragon, and Masaki. Alright, so pretty good 10. Compared to the 25k 10s, this was a fantastic 10. Let's go over what we did get in this video, then we're going to go over what we got overall. We got two foils and the blue eyes, which is about light play, so that's not bad. Destiny board, that is really cool. Ultra rare and giant trune with the spell, which is pretty awesome. I'm going to go over everything we got from all the tins. It's going to be pretty cool. All right, from all the tins, we have... Some of these are in different sleeves, so you got to bear with me. We have all of our promos here. All right, the blue eyes. I'm going to move that way. Where is the Jinzo? Oh, it was right in front of my face, so here we go. <laughs> two Jinzos, and then we have one, two Gear Frides. Then we have... The blue eyes. So there's all of our promos that we got. So you guys know those are in there, obviously, unless you have some error like DDS. <laughs> but then for the foils we pulled, we pulled Super Rare Suijin, Super Rare Giant True Nade, pulled a Kaiku, we pulled a Fire Princess, Nobleman of Crossout, Mahavilo, Arnesia Elephantis. Those are all the Super Rares we pulled from all the 10. So that is three, six, seven Super Rares. We pulled, for Ultra Rares, we pulled a Destiny Board from Labyrinth of Nightmare. We got a Magic Jammer. We pulled Left Arm of the Forbidden One, Guy of the Fierce Knight, and of course, Blue Eyes White Dragon. So LOB was actually incredibly good to us. We got three Ultra Rares out of 12 packs. The ratios are 1 in 12. So getting one was about the ratio. We got three, so that was incredible. Then we got one Secret Rare from all the packs. We got a Magic Cylinder. That's about ratio, about what do we open? 60 packs. So maybe a little bit under ratio. It'd probably be 1 in 48 or so. We got one secret rare. We got four, five ultra rares and 12 super rares. So we got 13 foils. So we averaged just over one foil per 10. That's about what I would expect. It was just funny that the 25k special happened to have all the duds. It had all the duds in the same video. It had four duds. There was only four tens that had nothing in them. The other eight had at least one foil, but four were in the same video. So it's kind of crazy. So overall, we did... About what you'd expect from tins. I can put up the total value on here if I can figure it out and show you what we did. And we definitely took an L, but that's okay because it was extremely fun. Hope you guys did enjoy it. And I'm hoping that we can do the 2002 tins soon. See you guys later. Thanks for watching. Peace. It's the original art. Yes! Yes! Okay, Galaxy actually. First pack!